if the radius of bohr orbit for second excited state of lithium 2 plus ion is x angstrom then radius in angstrom of beryllium 3 plus ion in its ground state will be the options are x by 2 the next is x by 12 the next is x by 3 and the last is 4x by 3 so student first of all i'm writing the formula to calculate bohr's radius which is bohr radius is equals to 0 0.529 n square upon z angstrom so let's proceed the question students in this case we are given that the radius of Bohr's orbit of second excited state of lithium 2 plus second excited state means third shell is x angstrom and we have to calculate the radius of beryllium 3 plus in its ground state so let's relate radius of third shell of li 2 plus upon radius of first shell of beryllium 3 plus in both the cases 0 0.529 will be common so that will be cancelled so in numerator we are left with n square upon z square and the value of n for lithium is 3 already given and the value of z is 3 since we know z represents atomic number and the atomic number of lithium is 3 numerator square since it is given it is n square and for beryllium 3 plus the value of n is 1 so 1 square upon the atomic number of beryllium is 4 which is ultimately equals to 9 upon 3 multiplied by 4 this is 3 that means equals to 12 since we are given that the radius of third orbit of lithium 2 plus is x so we can calculate the radius of first orbit of beryllium 3 plus since the value we have calculated is 12 so radius of first orbit of beryllium 3 plus is equals to x divided by 12 angstrom so that means the correct answer for this question is option number 2 moving to next question students which is 62 the electronic configuration of ytterbium atomic number 70 is student i'm writing the electronic configuration of ytterbium yb atomic number 70 is xenon 4f14 5d0 6s2 that means the correct answer is option number 2 moving to next question students which is 63 minimum wavelength of emitted photon of bastion series for hydrogen atom is the options are 1 upon rh the next is 3 upon rh the next is 9 upon 2 rh and the last is 9 upon rh and we are given that rh is the Rydberg constant for hydrogen atom so there's a formula to calculate lambda which is wavelength i'm writing it 1 upon lambda is equals to rh z square 1 upon n1 square minus 1 upon n2 square and also we know that for series limit of bastion series the value of n1 is equals to 3 and the value of n2 is infinity so let's put the values 1 upon lambda is equals to rh the atomic number of hydrogen is 1 so it will become 1 square 1 upon 3 square 1 upon infinity so 1 upon lambda is equals to rh upon 9 so we can calculate lambda which is equals to 9 upon rh which is Rydberg constant that means the correct answer for this question is option number 4 moving to next question students if a 40 watt source emits electromagnetic radiation of wavelength 1200 nanometer then number of quanta ejected per second will be the options are 2.4 into 10 to the power 20 the next is 2.4 into 10 to the power 18 the next is 4.4 into 10 to the power 20 and the last is 4.4 into 10 to the power 19 in this question we are given with the value of Planck's constant which is h which is equals to 6.63 into 10 to the power minus 34 joule second student first of all we are given with the power which is 40 watt and we know that this 40 watt represents energy 
emitted in one second which is equals to 40 joules since 40 what means 40 joules per second and now we can see that we are given with the wavelength of electromagnetic radiation which is 1200 nanometer and we all know that energy of one photon is given by hc by lambda so let's assume the number of photons ejected b n so 40 joules is equals to energy of one photon multiplied by number of photons and by this we can calculate the number of photons ejected which is equals to 40 into lambda upon h into c let's put the values lambda has a value of 1200 nanometer that means 1200 into 10 to the power minus 9 since nano represents 10 to the power minus 9 upon the value of h is already given which is 6.63 into 10 to the power minus 34 multiplied by cc a speed of light which has a value of 3 into 10 to the power 8 now students have calculated the entire value which is equals to 2413.3 into 10 to the power 17 which is equals to 2.4 into 10 to the power 20 that means the correct answer is option number 1 Moving to next question students which is 65. The number of electrons in chromium atom for which n plus l is equals to 4 is. The options are 4, 5, 7 or 10. So student first of all I am writing the electronic configuration of chromium which has atomic number 24. 1 s 2, 2 s 2, 2 p 6, 3 s 2, 3 p 6. 4s1 and 3d5 since the value of n plus l is equals to 4 which is given in the question so let's find out the orbital which has the value of n plus l is equals to 4 3p has n plus l value 4 and also 4s has n plus l value 4 and we can clearly see that in 3p and 4s combinedly they have 7 electrons so that means the correct answer is option number 3 the number of electrons in 3p is 6 and that of 4s is 1 so the total number of electrons is equals to 7 so the correct answer is option number 3 moving to next question students which is 66